Hello everyone, my name is Savannah Kirkland. I had the wildest dream involving Beyonce and Jay-Z in Brooklyn. I just had to share it with you all. It all started with me stuck in New York taxi amongst heavy traffic. I was growing increasingly frustrated as the minutes ticked by knowing I had to pick up my children from school. The clock was ticking closer to closing time and the stress was building up. Finally, I decided I couldn't wait any longer. I paid the driver and jumped out of the cab, figuring I could make it on foot as I navigated through the congested streets, weaving between pedestrians and dodging impatient cars. I could feel the street energy pulsing around me, the sound of honking horns, chatter, and the distant hum of subway trains creating a familiar yet chaotic symphony. I was on a mission, focused on getting to my children, but then something incredible happened. As I approached a busy intersection, I noticed a crowd gathered in a buzz of excitement in the air. Curious, I glanced over and couldn't believe my eyes. It was Beyonce and Jay-Z casually strolling down the street with their daughter Blue and their adorable twins. Seeing them in such a public, relaxed setting was so real. It was no entourage or no security detail, just the family walking together and enjoying the day. The sight of Beyonce and Jay-Z, the world's iconic figures, created a, a momentary frenzy. Yet, what stuck with me the most was the respect everyone showed them. People stopped and stared, of course, but no one approached them to invade their space. It was as if their presence commanded a natural respect and admiration. As I continued on my way, still marveling at the encounter, I noticed Jay-Z getting into a heated discussion with a teenage boy who seemed to be talking to Blue. My protective instinct kicked in and without thinking, I rushed over to see what was happening. Recognizing the young man from somewhere, I reassured Jay-Z that the boy was harmless. The tension eased and Jay-Z thanked me with a nod. The next part of the dream was even more astonishing. Somehow I found myself invited to their home despite its modest size. The house had a cozy charm that made it feel welcome. The walls were adored with the family photos and art, adding to the homely atmosphere. I could hear Jay-Z playing with the twins in another room while Beyonce, Blue Ivy, and I relaxed on the living room couch. The whole experience felt incredibly personal and intimate, as if I was part of the family for that brief moment. Beyonce leaning on my left shoulder and Blue resting her head on my lap it was such a surreal and heartwarming scene. Blue Ivory looked up at her mom and asked, Mom, are you ready for me to start dating? Because it's time to meet my boyfriend, who were the same young man from earlier today. Beyonce, with a calm and reassuring voice, responded, It's not a big deal, Blue. I couldn't help but chime in and say, Yes, it is a big deal because you're Beyonce. She quickly lifted her head up off my shoulder roll her eyes at me playfully and then settle back down feeling a bit puzzled i asked her do you not like being famous or do you sometimes forget that you are famous she sighed deeply and shared yes i often forget these days because most of the time i'm with my family and close friends and no one treat me differently but when i go out into the real world I'm unpleasantly reminded of my fame. I don't like when people make a big deal over me or start to cry because they're meeting me. It makes me feel uncomfortable and weird like I don't know what to do at that moment. I'm only human and I want to be treated like one. Our conversation was interrupted with my daughter walking into the room, loudly announcing, Mom, it's time to go. I tried to ask Beyonce one more question but my daughter's voice grew louder. Mom, it's time to go. When I looked up at her, I woke up from my dream to find my daughter standing over me, just like in the dream saying, Mom, it's time for me to go. The dream ended with my daughter waking me up, but the feeling of warmth and connection with Beyonce and her family lingered. So this was my dream about Beyonce and her family. I was shocked by this dream. There was nothing demonic only love and peace. I felt that y'all was guiding me to pray for her.
If the Most High Yah allows you to pray for Beyonce and her family, please do so. Feel free to share this dream and let me know your thoughts. Have you ever had such a vivid dream about a celebrity? Oh, <laughs> 